Hi, this is Lori from Grandma Says So, and today I'm going to bring you uh, some wonderful Fairy Morris products that I've been using to start my very first garden. Now, I grew up on a farm, and my mother gardened, and uh, it was rather like a punishment to have to go to the garden and hoe and work. Uh, that's what I thought back then. It's funny how life makes a full circle, and I find myself now gardening, and I feel much different about it today than when I was a kid growing up on the farm and uh, having to do chores and work in Mom's garden. So, today we're going to be talking about some foreign, Fairy Morris seeds. Uh, the planter, the decorative planter that Fairy Morris... Um, sent me. Actually, you could get this, uh, they sell these kits, they're decorative kits, uh, good gift products from their other company called uh, Green Arbor. So, they have lots of gift products on Green Arbor. And you can buy them, I found them on Amazon, uh, Google them, or just read my blog. Another item I want to mention, I've actually used this one, uh, is the Jiffy Greenhouse, and this is the Jiffy Plus Greenhouse kit. It has the, the pods in it, and you will just add water and then add your seeds. These pods will get taller. They'll, they'll soak up the water. They'll wick, wick the water up, get taller, and that will be your medium, your soil, for growing your seeds. comes in a tray. Uh, you can just pour water in the tray and it will uh, constantly keep your, your pods at a, at a not wet, wet. You don't want your pods wet, wet. You just want them damp. So then the top will go over the tray to give it the greenhouse effect. I've talked about this before on my blog. We will be giving two 50 starter kits away on my blog, so be sure to enter the giveaway. Um, I've also talked about this, the giveaway is still going on for the wonderful tote bag and tools that Fairy Morris sent, and they sent an extra three to give away to three of my readers, so I'm pretty excited about that. I have my seeds inside that I've already started. Um, here in Wyoming, it's not time to plant outdoors yet. Uh, we have a short growing season. We're at over 6,000 elevation, 6,000 feet elevation. And so it'll be a little bit before I can actually go outside and start digging in the dirt. Now, the kit I just showed you, the pods, will expand to this, this big. Here's a tomato plant that I planted. And uh, as you can see, it's coming up fine. You see the root system. The netting, that keeps your, your soil, your medium, kind of uh, compact so it isn't all over a place. Now this actually just sets in a tray that I have over under my fluorescent lights. I'm using that because uh, we've had not very much sun at all. And uh, the lighting actually helps to grow the plant. So, if you're going with the trays, they have a different size and after you add water, the pods will expand to this size. And uh, this one comes with 72 in a tray, so you can start a lot of seedlings. Like I said, you just add water, and uh, boom, you know, you put your seed in there. This is a pepper plant. Don't ask me what kind of pepper. I got all confused with my markings over there. So, that's kind of what they do. That's what they look like. Now, you might be wondering if I plan to have like an 800 acre garden with all these seeds. No. <laughs> no. I'm going to have a, a garden, raised garden beds and, and that. But Fairy Moore sent me these seeds to share with you. The readers of Grandma Says So, Fairy Moore's fans, you can find them on Facebook. And I'm going to be having a giveaway and people are going to be winning a lot of seeds from me. Let's just talk about the type that they sent me. Now, 
These are organic. And what's the difference between organic, you know, uh, and just regular seeds? The organic 100% certified organic seeds are approved by the USDA. They don't have pesticides in them. Uh, they come from plants that didn't have pesticides. 100% uh, organic. And uh, you might pay a little more for organic seeds, uh, but you know that they took the extra steps to make sure that these seeds did not, that there are no herbicides, pesticides, or any of the gunk that may be in other seeds, which I just learned that because. I knew, and I didn't know the difference between organic seeds I, and regular seeds. I had to look it up, which I did, and I asked around. Now, we have some lettuce, cucumbers, carrots. I mean, don't, this looks good enough to eat, right? Well, you can. You can. You just got to do a little work and grow it. And I do recommend you do that. Start your garden this year. I'm going to be showcasing how to do gardens and raised beds. Also, I will be showing uh, how to do gardens if you just have a tiny little patio. Because I have some containers. We're going to do some container gardening, growing vegetables in containers. This is all new to me, folks. So you'll see a lot of trial. You'll see a lot of error. Uh, because I'm learning as I go. I'm trying to recall... Uh, 40 some years ago when I worked alongside my mom as a kid in the garden but you know like I said I felt much differently about gardening then than I do today and I'm really glad I decided to go forth plant a garden for our family to, to hopefully be able to enjoy the fruits of of my labor this is grandma says so read how you can win Fairy Morris Seeds, 100% USDA Organic Seeds, and you know what, Fairy Morris, they guarantee them to grow. Bye-bye.